Hi, I have with me a Wacom Intuos 5 Touch. It comes in three sizes, small, medium and large. This particular one I have over here is medium sized. Now, for those who are not used to why I use a digital tablet, first off, it's a lot faster to edit photos compared to a mouse because the brush strokes using a pen, it's a lot more natural. There are also 2048 levels of sensitivity compared to the mouse, which is just one. It's either on or off. Uh, this allows me to vary the brush size or opacity depending on how hard I do the brush stroke. The Intuos 5 is now touch capable. Uh, this means I can use it essentially like a mouse. Uh, there are different gestures and standard gestures include uh, two fingers to do scrolling, three fingers to navigate back and forth uh, web pages, uh, and four fingers perhaps if you swipe it down, this will then allow me to navigate my apps. The Intuos 5 has some notable improvements over the Intuos 4. Uh, namely, the, the feedback that's on, on the tablet. Pr on the Intuos 4, I'm not able to tell what button my finger is over without having to take my eyes off the screen to look at the tablet. On the Intuos 5, the buttons are now capacitive. So as I move my fingers over the buttons, the screen shows feedback on what my finger is actually over. Uh, the touch ring also has little lights that surrounds it. So as I press the middle button here, it cycles around the various tools which will allow me to, in this case, for example, rotate the image over here or zoom as I switch through the various tools. There are now little indentations on the touch buttons uh, which gives you an indication of which button you're over. So you don't really have to take your eyes off the screen. Well, most of the time you want to connect via USB port, but the interesting thing is that it's wireless capable as well. So while right now you can see that it's connected to this computer over here, I can actually plug this off, and somehow I've actually plugged the USB key into this little port on this, this computer over here. And then you can see that it's actually working off the screen now. Quite cool. Well, the wireless module is accessible from the back and that's an option. I could slide this part off and you realize that this is the wireless module that you could purchase and add in and here's a little slot for you to insert the USB key so that you can carry it around. And this is the component for the removable battery. Yep, so just from the very short time that I have this, it looks like a pretty impressive upgrade. The ability to actually take this wirelessly and just put it on my lap or as I'm giving a presentation, draw it while I'm walking around using the shortcuts on my express key sounds fantastic. I may even be lazy and lie on my bed and use it as a touchpad. Well, I'll be the first in the line to get this.